Hey everyone, I'm inside a Costco here in Taiwan going to get some food at their food court. Interesting options they have. Bulgogi baked, seafood baked, pizza, crispy chicken bucket. They have pork hot dog, not a beef hot dog. Here's the counter. I think I'm gonna get the hot dog for 50 yuan. Perhaps an ice cream as well. All right, so I just got my food and I brought it outside. This Costco is just way too busy. There was no seating available, it was a lot of people, and I didn't want to stay in there. So I ended up just getting a hot dog with the soda combo, which is 50 yuan, about $1.50 US. So pretty much the same price as the US. They also gave me these right at the cash register, onions and a big packet of condiments, relish, uh, mustard, and ketchup, and the hot dog itself. Let's take a look. Since I don't have exactly the right setting to record this, excuse the camera angle and everything, but comes with a soda. I put some lemon tea in it, iced tea, nothing different from the US, but let's check out this hot dog. It's uh, pork, not beef, which is interesting. Well, uh, looks okay to me. I mean, it's orange in color, which is definitely pork. I also found that Costco's throughout the US, they're uh, Hot dog quality varies. I think the ones in Miami are better than the ones in New York for the hot dogs. But let's put some onions on it. Um, check out these condiments too. Interesting how they give you a packet of them and they're not um, like in the condiments area of Costco, which I find rather interesting. In the US, sometimes they run out and you gotta like, just deal with whatever condiments they have. I kind of like this method. Like it's really just quick service. Mustard, relish, and unknown red sauce, which I believe should be ketchup. Um, oh, here's the cut out for it. Let me just make sure it's ketchup. Yeah, it's ketchup, but um, tastes a little bit different, like a um, tad bit less sweet. All right, ketchup, mustard, Looks like a yellow mustard to me, like nothing interesting. And relish. The relish isn't exactly coming out that well. Kind of have to like squirt it out of here. Yeah, it's not really coming out that well, this relish. It's kind of watery too. I actually like the way they do relish in the US better. They have it like in the, if something flew out, I don't know what it was. Um, they have it in a, a machine and it kind of like rolls out, but here's the final hot dog with the toppings that I put on. Alright, moment of truth is 
Costco Taiwan pork hot dog better than United States Costco. You know, this is um, very interesting. Um, definitely a lot less salty than um, hot dogs in the US. Um, it's much lighter in taste, but that's just due to the pork than the beef. Um, as far as the condiments go, the relish tastes really good. A um, little bit tangy. Similar to the relish in the U.S. as well. Um, I already said the ketchup. The ketchup is less sweet, but the mustard, I really can't feel a difference. As for the bun, um, I kind of like it, actually. It's um, kind of soft in texture, and it's not soggy. I've been to Costco's. I don't know why, where the buns are, like, super, super soggy, but this actually works out. course you can't really complain about the price either it's 50 nt which is a dollar 50 us which i don't know how long they're gonna keep it at a dollar 50 us or 50 nt throughout their warehouses because i know it's a loss leader they actually have that to draw people to come into the store and people love it they um actually like lose money on every hot dog combo that they sell Well, I say this is pretty decent. I mean, I actually can't say that I prefer the Taiwanese Costco hot dog better. I actually like the beef hot dogs. They taste a lot more firm and it just um, feels more real to me than these. These is kind of like, um, they're not salty, um, they're not as like thick, I would say, as like the like, beef hot dogs. And even though I'm not really that big of a fan of like heavily salted foods, I think for a hot dog, you kind of really need it. I don't know how their other menu items are. I saw bulgogi bake and seafood bake, which is kind of interesting. And they also had like a seafood pizza and Hokkaido ice cream. And um, what else did I see there that was like unique? Those are the ones off the top of my head. Oh, they also had, um, yeah, I forgot. Those might've been interesting to get, but there's no way I could like carry it all and review it outside when there's like not much space available. I had to do what um, I had to with the space I had. But overall, good experience at Costco. Super busy in there before the Lunar New Year. Hope you enjoyed it. I know I had a good experience here in Costco <laughs> just checking it out. Hit the thumbs up two thumbs up if you want as far as this meal um can't really say i recommend it but it's a two thumbs up on the price for sure see you later bye, -bye.